uh, since we last played a game. Um, we're back this Saturday. How are you feeling ahead of the game? Yeah, we're, we're all looking forward to it. It was uh, um, obviously it's been a difficult time, a long time, a uh, long time of not knowing. But once we uh, once we got the green light, um, it was great to see the lads again, albeit you know in small groups to start with. But um, great to see them back on the training ground, um, looking good, Nick. You know they've looked after themselves well. Um, but because of the you know because of the scenario, we've pushed them quite hard as well. So uh, they've stood up a lot of sort of hard work uh, during that time until we could get into the football. And then since the football started, we, we look good. We've got a couple of. Uh, Couple of injuries as you probably get at any pre-season, um, you know, but uh, hopefully we'll, we'll know today what, what we're going to have available by uh, by the end of training. Yeah, obviously um, Oxford beating Chester three two. Uh, did you watch the game and what do you think of it? Yeah, me and Mickey both watched the game. We were sort of concentrating on the team each just to uh, just to cover all bases. Um, I thought it started really well. Uh, you, you know, we know enough about Alti. We, we've always found them a difficult opponent. Uh, we we done well against them at the start of last season after a break, um, and then they they came to our place twice in the cup and done well against us. Uh, so we know we know we know the dangers, we know the threats. They've got some good footballers. They play a good style of football. Parky Parky has a, a really good philosophy on football. Um, but you know we know what we need to do: concentrate on on ourselves, um, mainly this weekend. Um, and and the team, you know, the team I pick will, will be the team who I think is probably the most ready. As opposed to you know just just picking a team every week, um, you know I've had a I've had a good month to assess who's who's ready, who looks who looks like they're going to come flying out the blocks, um, and that's 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 what we we look at as well as you know fitting into our system and the way we want to play. Yeah, and obviously it'll be the fourth time you play them this season. Will this be the the best time to maybe get revenge? Um, you know what? It's it's it's. Been 20 weeks, so I, I don't think what, what happened last season. Um, although we know enough about each other, um, will have that much relevance, really. It's certainly not a revenge mission. It's a case of us wanting to get promoted and, and, and winning two games. And whoever we come up against, we'd have the same mentality. Yeah, and obviously with the new rules, five substitutions, water breaks. There's quite a bit to think about during the game as well. Isn't there? there is, but we've you know we've we've had enough chance to see these games. Uh, pan out over this spell you know it's great to have the Premier League back great to be watching the championship again and you know for a long spell um, we didn't know whether it was going to be any football at all for us we didn't know um, what the scenario would be promotions relegations there was, there was talk about being none then there was talk about being um, only the one and then the points per game came in which cut us off by the knees a little bit but we are where we are now, so we know what we've got to do. We've got uh, our task simple, same as same as everybody else who's still involved in the playoffs. Now it's it's two games to achieve a goal, um, and from that point of view, we're, we're really looking forward to it. Yeah, and obviously with the big layoff as well, and, and these two games, are the lads sort of treating this as a new season, and putting the last one behind you. Well, I mean, obviously there's a lot went right last season. There's, there's mistakes along the way, but you know, every single team, possibly outside of Liverpool, could say that. So you know, that's 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 the way it is. It was a new, it was a new challenge for me. Um, new set of lads. We started off great. Um, we know what we're capable of doing. We know that at our best, we're capable of beating anybody in the league. Um, so that's a mentality you're going to have to go in this weekend with. And but. You know, other teams will have other teams will have their own views on things, and they'll they'll no doubt back themselves as well. So, um, it's a one-off game, and uh, we're, we're ready for it. Is it a chance for some of the lads to impress as well in these two games to maybe get the offer next year? Well, yeah, I, mean, I don't want to put that type of pressure on them, but you know that I suppose they're the facts. And ultimately, we've only got three signed players for next season. Um, two of them are goalkeepers. They're very good keepers, and Paddy. So, um, so yeah, it goes without saying that, that you know. The, these, these two games as well is going to come into uh, the thoughts of next season and, and, and you know, I'm assuming I would think they'd all love to stay at York you know it's, it's a fantastic city to play football in it's a great it's a great train facility you've got the you've got the new stadium on the, on the horizon uh, and we're going in the right direction you know I mean I, I think that's the main thing um, that we've, we've, we've kept telling ourselves over this spell you know it's from where we you know from where we have been unfortunately for, for four years um, this has been a massive stride in the right direction, and, and, and whatever happens, we're going we're to carry on with that momentum. Um, but obviously, to top it off, and the, the only thing, the only thing in my mind now is, is winning on Saturday. Yeah, just finally, you've obviously played some big games in your career as a player. As a manager, is this the biggest game so far for you? This is up there with the biggest games of, of my life. 
It really is, and, and you know the, the the lads have the lads have got to look at it the same way. We're, we're lucky in respect that we've got um, we've got lads who have experienced it. You know, big big Steve's been a it has been and is going to be a big help going into this. Uh, our books, we're lucky enough to have got books back, who uh, who's a great footballer and he's been through all this. You know, Newt Paddy, we've got some good experience. Uh, who, who have uh, who will help the younger lads through this um, as well as me? And, and for me, as a, as a relatively young manager, you know, I'm not I wouldn't say I'm particularly young in life, but as a manager, it's only sort of me um, sort of first full season, I suppose. I've, I've I've joined teams halfway through seasons before, and even this wasn't a full one. But um, but yeah, it, it's a new it's a new to me as well, and I'm uh, I'm just looking forward to getting going.